Hello, hello guys. It's Kanisha with Currency Queen Budgets. I am back with another video and we will be talking about a lot. Hey y'all, it's been a while. So if you are new, first of all, let me say welcome and welcome back to my channel, to my returning subscribers and watcher supporters i really appreciate you all and as you guys know or you may not know you may have not even noticed that i've been off for um the month of may i have not uploaded any new videos um uh, for may i did have some videos left over from april that i did um in May, so it was kind of sparingly in May whenever I thought about it or had time to get that video edited and published. I uploaded those videos and you guys have still been supporting me. Um, my subscriber count is still going up and I really appreciate you guys, even though I have not been active on here like I was, guys. Okay, so where have I been? So I've been here around, nothing major. Um, has been going on guys i've just been so busy and then i had a lot of um work done to my house and you know they're still doing repairs and things around here so i moved all of my money out of my safe into the bank and i took a screenshot but i'll put this screenshot up here so you guys can see that that money has been deposited in a bank and i think i have a um a copy of a deposit slip I will also put that here so you guys can see that I did do some changes around here because I had people in my house. I wasn't home all the time when they were here. Sometimes my um, my oldest boys was here, but they don't pay. They're not paying attention to where these repair men are at. I know that wasn't. Um, they was just here to let them in and make sure everything went okay. So in order for me to feel comfortable. I just went ahead and moved everything that I had in my safe and my savings challenges and everything. I moved that to the bank just so I can have a peace of mind, guys. Because like I said, I don't know these guys. And even when people that I do know, I don't trust them enough to um, be in my house like that. And I'm not here. So um, that's first things first. Um, and the next thing... Well, I haven't had a chance to do any videos, guys, because May was so busy. My son graduated. I had his sister and his girlfriend graduated, and I had a lot of cousins that graduated. So it was like May has been so busy for me. I've been doing cake orders like every weekend of May. I've been trying to keep up with my Etsy stores and Shopify, guys. You guys definitely been keeping me busy on the budget end. But I just wanted to get on here to let you guys know that I am still around. Everything is okay. And hopefully I am able to get back in the swing of making these videos. And I think I kind of burned myself out because I was making videos, trying to do them every day or on a Saturday or Sunday that I had free. I was making all of my videos in one day and then trying to edit them and i think i just got kind of burnt out on top of everything else that i doing that i'm doing because i am a single mom and y'all know how that goes with single mom duties and oh i got a dog y'all i got my daughter a dog i got it for her but i think it's kind of mine because <laughs> she don't do anything for her i take care of the dog y'all and that's like a whole baby i didn't know that um taking care of a dog is like uh, a huge huge responsibility so that dog has been keeping me busy trying to get them house broken and trained and stuff y'all trying to take them walk in i'm still on um tr on my journey to my weight loss i have not been doing um everything that i needed to do right but i am eating much better i'm basically eating once a day now i'm still doing my juice in the morning and at night and i've dropped a total of 17 pounds so far so that is um good news <laughs> that i can be proud of myself about um what else oh i've been doing a lot of yard work guys i've been trying to get things done in my backyard is horrible i think i'm going to do a video eventually once we get it to where I want it to be, but I am doing like little clippings and recording here so I can get my video together once we get done, y'all. And it was horrible. Um, I'm 
my boy's been over here helping me out a lot with the yard too so i have still been budgeting and um and while I'm on here just running my mouth, I'm just going to go ahead and change out my envelopes because I did do some new envelopes. And y'all know I have to do envelopes, new envelopes every month. It's just a thing that I have about myself. So I'm just going to put those to the side and then I'm going to put my new envelopes in here. So what I did was I just created some new envelopes and I wanted to try to do wider envelopes and I think I like these um and these are a new style as well they go to the side instead of up and down we have them to the side here so I just thought these was cute and I just made my pictures um I put my I thought these would be cute, you know, something different. Y'all, and don't judge this envelope because I messed it all up. I didn't notice that this was here until now. But I was, um, look at all them hole punches, y'all. Don't judge me. So, um, with these envelopes being larger, they're wider, and they are a little bit longer than the other ones. I think they are. They're just a little bit. They're just a little bit longer, not that much longer. Um... But I didn't pay attention to my hole punch, what it was set on. Y'all, I don't know what it was set on. It just set on everything. But I think I'm just going to... I may remake this one, but I may just keep it. Because who's going to be in my wallet? Nobody with me. Um, But yeah, so I did do some new new envelopes here. And I think I got to put this on the third one. Yeah, because when I tell you my hole punch was so jacked up, and I think it's still jacked up, I might have to remake this one. Okay, no, I don't. Um, I've still been budgeting, um, but I have not been budgeting and keeping up like I should. Let me zoom this out just a little. I have not been budgeting like I should cause, because I have swiped that card. I use my credit card. Um, but I was kind of th thrown off a little with the changes that's been going on around here and trying to keep up with everything so yeah and i can tell the difference y'all i need this budgeting in my life because it helps me stay on track so i'm going to just do these um videos more I'm going to say more. I'm going to start back doing my budgeting videos and making sure I'm putting money where it needs to be um, and not using my debit card so much. But like I said, it was just a thing of having cash on me with all these different people in and out my house. Y'all, that just didn't sit right with my heart, with my mind, my body, my spirit, <laughs> my soul. So, um, yeah, money was, is very limited right now for me until we get everything everything situated and we are back to normal in my house so we are going to <clears throat> so what i'm um i'm just going to go through and take out the money that i have in these envelopes and i'm just going to swap them into here i hope y'all don't feel like i'm rambling because i i just want to let y'all know what's been going on and i do miss you guys i do miss um talking to you guys now i do have now i do uh appreciate you guys that continue to watch the videos and comment to y'all that made me feel so special because i know i haven't i haven't i haven't not what i haven't been um releasing any new videos but you guys have still been stopping by i even had some people check in with me via email and etsy to make sure everything was going okay and everything is just fine and, oh, I did add some um, transaction slips to the back of these envelopes as well. But I thought they was something different, and they're a little bit cute. You know, I have to have my dolls, and I kind of match the color to go with the theme. See, she's blue, and her word is blue. So, I was just, you know, trying to have a little bit of fun. I took a little road trip down to Texas. Um, me and my daughter. Uh, so, and I'm saying um a lot. I don't know why. Um, household doesn't have anything. 
spending has 10. But yeah, that is my life and what it's been. And I am kind of loving this wider envelope. I like this. Can y'all see how much space it has? And I'm thinking about putting these on my store because these will be good for like those savings challenges um, to do them a little bit wider. And let's go for beauty. Let's see what we have in here. Y'all know I have to keep my hair, uh, my hair money. I got to keep my nail money, y'all. I don't know. I'm trying to say my hair and my nails together, I guess. But this is for my nails. Um, Because I do have locks and I do those myself. And I kind of want to do a lock journey, but I kind of don't like my locks. <laughs> I want to cut them out every single day. It's like I want to cut them and then start over. But... I know once I cut them, I'll be regret regretting it. So that is it for all of those. But I will go back and let you guys see all of my envelopes. Um, but you guys know the categories. And let me know what you guys think down in the comment about these envelopes. Do you think they are cute? Because I do miss my zip envelopes and the thing that I do like about my zip envelopes is that it goes this way and it makes it easier instead of trying to um, cash stuff the other way but I do like these I should have did them clear backs but I am still in love with these so. um, and I also have some happy mail and uh, I did a savings challenge even though I have not been doing my big savings challenges. I did another penny savings challenge. So I have been keeping up with that and also keeping up with my dollar savings challenge. And I also have some happy mail. I know y'all know who this is from. You can look at the sticker and tell who it's from. It's from Erica from Black and Blue. I will put her name across the screen right here you guys can go over and check her out guys she is so so awesome but you guys know and i bet some of you all can guess what it is because i have been talking about this for a long time and i finally got around to purchasing it in april no it was the end of march i think i purchased it let me look at my um pack and slip to be sure but i think it was the end of march when I purchased this and it's been laying on my desk this whole time. <gasps> oh my God. Ah! Yeah, wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> it is so beautiful. Okay, first, 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 first. Hold on. Okay, so this is the thank you card. Guys, look. Y'all, I love handwritten thank you cards. Okay, y'all, so her name of her new shop is Make It Bling. And here is her information on Insta and um, YouTube. And her website is Make It Bling. And I'll link that. Um, I'll put the link to her website in the description as well. But she says, thank you so much for your support. Let me start over. I think I'm too excited. I can't pronounce support. <laughs> So it says, thank you so much for your support. I hope you enjoy. And she put a little baby unicorn. Isn't it so cute? I'm going to use this for, um, and then look guys, she put that in the place of, of, it said place your stamp here. And she put it on with this little cute paper clip. Oh my gosh. Where you get this from April? April. Where'd you get this from Erica? I love it. <sighs> look y'all. Look, 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 look. I love this. This is so cute. Y'all see that little paper? Girl, you got to let me know where you got these from. I love it. I could use those in my planners. Oh, my God. That is so freaking cute. Okay. So, I'm going to set this to the side. And I'm going to use both of those. That sticker and that paper clip in my planner okay so let's jump to what i ordered y'all and it is so beautiful 
Now look at this. It's for my scratch off. And y'all know I love colors and this goes perfect. I don't want to tear this hard, but I listen. I just gotta get into this so I can put my hands on it. Oh, it's so beautiful, y'all. Look, hold on. Look, Erica, you are so dope. Can y'all see that? <laughs> Look at it. Make it bling, y'all. Oh, I can't wait to do a scratch off. Oh, it's so beautiful. And it, oh my God, Erica. I think I need another. I need an ink pen like this. I'm going to order an ink pen. Erica, can I order an ink pen like this? Oh my God, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And guess what else she sent, y'all? Who would have thought that she would send me some washi tape? Oh, I love my washi tape. She sent me some washi tape. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, that is so perfect. Erica, thank you, girl. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I love it. I love it. I love it. I can't wait to use this. I need a stand or something to keep this on my desk. Oh, it's so cute. I'm so excited. Um, <laughs> But yeah, guys. So that has been the story of my life. That's where I've been. But I do plan on getting back on track. I'm going to um be doing my A5 planners. I'm going to um be doing more of those. I have gotten behind on those. I don't think I did, but a couple of them this year. So um, I'm getting everything together to get that back on track as well as my budget and getting all these videos back on time. Like I said, I really appreciate you guys that you stuck, stuck in there with me, even though I kind of fell off the bandwagon. Um, for a little while but i'm not gonna hold you guys too too long look <laughs> i gotta keep showing this to y'all because i love it i can't stop touching it it's so beautiful i want everything in this <laughs> so um yeah so i think that is all that i needed to get on here to tell you guys to inform you of what is going on or what has what's or what's been going on in my life but we are going to get back on track as soon as we have our next payday but as always guys i want you to hustle hard budget hard and pray harder until the next video guys be blessed queenies bye